So today is Sunday guys and this is my outfit for today. And sabi ko kasi Sunday I want to do something new. So something I've never really tried before. So sabi ko, why don't we go to Sip and Go? I've always wanted to uh, try out that place ever since I saw it kay Riza and kay Patrick. So nagpaint sila doon and basically um per session is 1000 pesos. Kakabok ko lang kanina ng umaga kasi kanina pagising ko. Kasi sabi ko I want to do something today. Kasi nga di ba Sunday and wala sayang naman ang buhay kapag wala akong gagawing bago. So anyway, um for my makeup, very fresh. For my lips, same thing. I got uh, I used the Hydra Bloom from Makeup Forever and Live from Colorit. So it's the color tint. Everything else the same then. I did a video ba dito? Parang. Yeah. Anyway, finally nakausog na ako dun sa um backlog ko. Okay, kasi pag naaano ko sa mga vlogs, ang ginagawa ko, I mean, kapag nastuck ako sa isang vlog, or kunwari, di ba, I need to upload like 10 vlogs, hindi ako makausad kasi nga, nastuck pa ako sa Canon. So, yeah, I was able to edit 4 vlogs last night. I, I slept at 7am. So, yun, naka-upload na yung tatlo, na, dalawa, and then yung isa mamayang 6pm ma um ma public so that's it we're gonna go muna to sip and go and then perhaps we're gonna go grab dinner at Gino's brick oven pizza because I wanna try the burrata from Gino's now here at sip and goes at the seat go um since open session siya pwede kang pumili kung anong gusto namin i-paint okay pili muna oh sorry pili muna tayo kung anong ipipaint natin Okay, so I've chosen my painting. Actually, and I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. Serve ng cheese and the wine, the mash. Although hindi sila super pareho, pero oh my gosh, mas maganda yun na kaka na pa. <laughs> what I came up with, ay yung coffee namin. Okay lang, mas maganda yun. Mas maganda pa siyempre, pero okay lang din. I provide sila sa inyo na kind of paper bag and then you just put your painting inside. Love it! So I'm done. Bongo. I made 
on time. I'm with Leah. Hi, Hi Leah. Hi. We're preparing for the live session. Excited! Watch 12 o'clock. Yay! <laughs> and if ever you want to vlog, I'll have the link in the information box so they save naman all the live sessions here at Lazada. Yeah. <laughs> Love your hair. Ang aga ko ng gising. Hindi mo sa kanan na sa Yes, yes, no problem. We're done with the live. Okay, hindi ako nakablog, pero ayan yung screen. <laughs> Love it. I'm covered in swatches. I'm finally home and I'm gonna make kwento ko ano nangyari today. So, I stayed up all night kasi nga, I was like super um, kinakabahan about the US visa interview which was this morning. It was scheduled at 8.30 and I woke up at 6.45. Buti nga nag, ano ko eh. Alam niyo ba, yung, yung sinasabi ko sa inyong kwento na lagi may nag-doorbell sa akin, it still happens all the time. Like all the time, randomly may mga doorbell and then walang tao so i don't really know what to do anymore hinahayaan ko na lang actually kanina medyo parang it's super weird medyo creepy pero parang sakto lang kasi three times ako nag snooze ng alarm and yung third alarm sumabay sa doorbell di ba parang oh my gosh weird na parang bongga kasi nagising talaga ako Anyway, so nagmadali na ako. I had breakfast, yung okra, and then narealize ko na shocks kaya lang ako pala magmadali na kasi 8:30 nga yung ano, diba? So I have to leave the house by 7:15. So yun, um kumain ako, naligo ako, makeup konti para you know, to look presentable. And then I got I left my phone pala. So I've been asking everyone on Instagram, is it safe to leave my phone sa mga babae, yung mga lady dragons. Parang may organization or group ng ladies outside the embassy who offer uh, storage for people. Na, kasi ay, bawal nga sa embassy lahat ng electronics. So, I did not bring anything. Walang jewelry, walang watch. Pero kanina madami na watch And then, wala. Iniwan ko lang dito. Ako yung pinakahuli sa batch namin. Saktang-sakto when I got to the line. Um, yun, dire-diretso lang kami pumasok kami, finger scanning. Uh, yung first question sa isang window is bakit pupunta ng, ng US, sabi ko wedding, ganyan. Finger scan. M ang bilis actually, yung medyo matagal lang napila, actually hindi siya matagal lang napila, siguro mga 15 minute wait, was the interview. Hindi ko akala, ay nagganan lang pala yung interview, like booth-booth lang pala, grabe. And then, my gosh, like lahat ng mga nauna sa akin, Siguro mga sampo yung nabilang ko. Dire-diretso, deny, deny, deny. Like, blue slips lahat. Have ko shocks na kakaloka to. And, pinapunta ko sa window uh, 19. Oh my gosh, yung ini-interview. Nung lumipat ako sa, nung pumunta ako sa pilang yun, nakakatakot kasi parang tumataas yung boss ng consul. I was like, oh my gosh, nakakatakot at itong consul na napunta sa akin. And then, nag-open like, yung window 20. And then, sabi nung usher na parang, Dito na lang daw ako sa 20. Dapat hindi ako pumila. Yung family before me, lahat sila na-approve. It was my turn. Basic questions. As in, ano lang, lahat ng mga supporting documents na dinala ko, ni isa, walang tiningnan. Nakakaloka talaga, parang sabi ko, oh my gosh. And then, I got denied. Um, really stayed up late, just reading everyone's um, experiences online about the U.S. Embassy. And yung iba talaga grabe, like three times, four times, five times bago ma-approve. And naloka lang ako ng bongga, like sabi ko, shocks na kakaloka. So, yeah, blue slip. And then sabi lang niya na hindi daw, hindi ko daw na-proof na may socio-economic ties ako sa Philippines. And hindi mo na kasi pwede ma-argue yun eh, kahit anong sabihin mo sa kanya. Wala na eh, it's final. And you, do, you never really know the reason why you were denied a visa. So, sabi ko, okay, thank you. And then, blue slip. Oh. And then, yeah, I was really bummed at first. Although, I did really, I really did not get my hopes up talaga. Kasi I know US visa, mahirap. As in, mahirap talaga siya. Like, Japan and Korea, hindi ako nagkaroon ng problema. Like, first time 
na-apply ko, na-approve naman ako sa dalawa. Pero US talaga, never in a million years did I imagine myself like getting it in one try. Like, Ewan ko, nasa gut feeling ko rin na hindi ko siya makukuha. Ewan ko, for some reason lang talaga. But I really wanted to try. Kasi diba, it's the wedding of my friend. Si Lauren, a friend ko since grade school na kalaro ko sa volleyball. Since grade school, grade 3. Hanggang basta matagal ko siyang kaibigan. Kaya sabi ko, I, I have to try. I have to try. And ang dami ko nilakad na papers for that. Because I knew that having... Like the BIR, ITR, blah blah blah. Lahat yun, I, I thought makakatulong. Apparently not, or I don't really know. I don't really know. I have no idea what went wrong. Um, maybe it's just not meant to be. So I was really bummed. Because apart from this, I have a lot of things on my mind. Ang dami kong iniisip. As in, like, my gosh. Oh, so wala kong phone, di ba? Ang haba ng story time ko. Ang wala kong phone, lumabas ako ng embassy, nakakuha ako ng taxi. Nakipag-away pa ako ng konti sa taxi niyan kasi... Actually, hindi na ako nagpa-metro kasi sabi ko, walang kukuha sa akin pag metro. Sabi ko, 400, papalik na ng BGC. I mean, alam ko naman na, di ba? Tapos traffic pa. And then, I had to be home by 11. Kasi 11.30, may Facebook Live ako, may work ako in BGC. So sabi ko, girl, please, I cannot. Like, medyo okay na sa akin na, okay. I mean, kung nakuha ko na may visa, syempre, mas masaya ako, di ba? Pero at least for today, napuntahan ko lahat ng mga kailangan kong gawin. I mean, lahat na kailangan kong puntahan. I mean, lahat ng time sakto. And you know what's super funny about everything talaga? Like, I was super bummed. And then, I received the news about something. And that kind of, like, um, canceled out my bump, bumpness. Ba yun? Yeah, so, wala. It's just weird how God works in mysterious ways. Kasi, Wala lang. Kasi sobrang, talaga sobrang sad ko talaga. Like, super sad. Like, I was planning to do, you know, a lot of stuff. Hopefully, sana. Pero, apparently, it's not yet time for me to be going to the US. So, it's okay. Okay lang. Okay lang yun. Siyempre, pa-uwi ng car. Um, oh, yun. So, nag-live na ako. Nag-live session ako. And, throughout the live session, I'll have the link in the information box. Nag-live kami with Ofra. I really tried to put on a happy face, like, alam niyo naman, typical me, bubbly ganyan, bongga bongga. I was like faking it, like, sabi ko, hindi ko haya. I mean, syempre, di ba? Sad pa rin. I mean, I know I did not, like, have my hopes up naman talaga. Pero syempre, di ba, nakakalungkot pa rin. And nakakatawa pa dun sa, after ng interview, like, everyone, everyone could hear kung ano yung pinag-usapan nyo, kung may blue slip ka ba, or nakakuha ka ba ng, ng visa. So nakakatawa lang kasi parang feel ko, class all over again. <laughs> Nakakaloka. Second time ko na feel yan. First was when I did the painting session last week. Wala lang. It's, it's a cool experience. I mean, it's okay. I mean, okay lang yan. Um, ano pa ba? Oh, and then sabi, I, I met someone. She actually messaged me on Instagram. She works there. And sinabi ko nga na, denied nga. Sabi ko, kailan ulit mag, 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 pwede mag reapply She said, after 24 hours, pwede na. But then again, I'm not really sure if that would make any difference. So if ever you tried reapplying, assume, I mean, counting period lang difference nung denial and then reapplication nyo, please let me know how it worked out for you. Kasi sabi nila magiging iba na yung console, which is probably true. Pero, I don't know. I don't know what, I mean, I have a lot of things in my head na alam kong could have been the reason why, pero syempre hindi mababaliw ko, di ba? Hindi kasi hindi ko alam. Like, hindi naman nila sasabihin eh. I mean, never nila, never naman nila anuhin yun. But, okay lang. US, mahirap talaga. It's okay, it's okay. But best wishes to Lar and Wilfred. I hope to see you guys in the future. In the future. Pag time na. Anyway, uh, saya. September yung wedding eh. So anyway, um, ano pa ba? Oh, and I'm feeling very cheerful right now. Because I already cried. I cried to grab. Like, syempre kailangan kong umiyak kasi I'm... Ewan ko, I've been feeling very emotional lately. Like, sobrang emotional ko. Like, a lot of things are bothering me. After the live session, I went back home. And then I told myself, I'm feeling too dark. I can't stay in this darkness. You know, I've been talking to wifey then. Tapos sabi ko lang na parang... I, I keep remembering what wifey taught me to do when I feel dark or I feel down or blue is to run down. So, nag-change ako, tinakbo ko from here 
papuntang BGC. I mean, okay, five kilometers. I ran and walk, ran, walk, ran, walk. And then I had to meet someone for work then, mag sign ng documents and stuff. So tinakbo ko yung papunta doon. I signed the documents. And then, kumain ako sa salad stop. So that's my dinner. And then I walked back home. Yeah, I walked back home because sabi ko, I need to burn off all this energy that I have inside me. And usually kasi yung mga, like you know when you feel blue, yung energy na you have is so bigat. It's so heavy, it's so, um, it's bad, it's negative. And when you run, wish, feel ko na wala lang lahat. And sobrang pagod ako, pero I feel so much better. Um, dumating na rin yung package ko from Beauty MNL, yung Chris Aquino, so I'll be filming that tonight. And then, ano ba ba? Yeah, yun lang ang kwento ko for today. So I'm so sad that I got denied, but it's okay cause hindi naman siya yung denial na forever hindi kina pwede or blacklisted kina or whatever. You can still try, but it will cost you. You know, that cost me a lot of money. Like, aside from the visa fee itself, which was 8,000 pesos, 8,160 ba? Something like that, or $160. Uh, aside from that, kasi may iba pa, like, ang dami. Ang dami kong ginastos talaga lang. Pero okay lang. Everything happens for a reason, just not time. Like, oh, over and over again in my lifetime talaga. This first happened to me when I was just new on YouTube. And there was this project that I thought I already got. It was a big, 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 big project. And then napunta sa kalaban. <laughs> napunta sa ibang tao. Oh my gosh, yon talagang iniyakan ko ng bongga. And then something good, something better came along. Medyo after a few months lang. So sabi ko, ah okay, kaya ko pala hindi nakuha yon. So, medyo equipped na ako for this time. Although iniyakan ko pa rin siya ng konti lang naman because you know. Pero yon, gets. I get it, I get it, I get it. So yon, it's good then to like walk around BGC. Like I stopped, I literally stopped. To see, to check or to smell the roses or the flowers around, wala lang. And then, wala. Kita the mga doggies, like people watch, nagwalk, basa ang saya lang. So I feel tired, but I feel better, and that's always a good thing. So that's it. I really hope sa mga taong nagreapply as soon. I mean, in a short while after their denial, after their denial. Please let me know how it went for you. I mean, what happened? Let me know. Kasi ang dami. Ang dami talagang possibilities and that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog. And if you want to watch the live session, if you did not catch it, link in the information box. Thank you for watching. Spending time here in the living room because I'm hanging and I'm waiting for the sunset. And I need to work on a deck for tomorrow's talk. And I figured I should try to paint this. Now I don't really know. I don't have any background with watercolor painting, but I tried. Long way to go. Kit man. Pero hindi ko lang makuha yung mahirap yung ganyan. But yeah, I tried. It's very therapeutic. I love it. And thank you so much to Liz. She sent like her watercolor what's um, parang notes kasi dati nag-workshop siya. Ang galing ni Liz mong watercolor. I'll have her um, Instagram in the information box. She does amazing watercolor work. So, noob pa lang ako. So, pagbigyan, ito yung kahapon na nainis na ako. Nagsulat na ako ng Chinese name ko. Clerks. Anyway, so this is like my artwork area. Yeah, I still have to finish one of the deck. Para matapos na.